Queen Elizabeth pledges to serve for her whole life, sources dismiss rumors she has handing down duties to Charles. Latest reports confirmed that Queen Elizabeth has no plans to abdicate the monarchy and will pass down the throne to the first heir, Prince Charles. This original rumor was dismissed as it was claimed that the Queen pledged to serve the monarchy and the nation for her whole life. With the latest report on Mail Online, it seems like people will never witness a transition of the throne anytime soon and Charles needs to wait unless the Queen is already too sick to carry on her duties. This rumor also came out after Prince Philip retired from official duties just earlier this month. So far, the Queen is the longest reigning living monarch in history and has committed steadfastly to her role as long as her health allows her to do so she even insisted that it will be duty first and she is going to be there. Therefore, she has no plans to pass her official responsibilities to Charles. Moreover, it was reported before that Queen Elizabeth requested the Regency Act to come into force but sources close to the monarch refuted this report. They added that the Queen has always been so determined in saying that there will be no interference of Regency unless she is already too sick to the point that she can no longer perform her royal obligations. With this, neither the Clarence House nor the Buckingham Palace is preparing for this regency. According to the Times, the 1937 Regency Act allows the Queen to pass her power to her heir Charles if her ill health already prevents her from performing her royal functions. But still, the officials from the palace keep on refusing from giving comments on the developing reports that the Queen was to step aside. Furthermore, it is stated in the legislation that the regent can perform the duties of the Queen should the monarch be declared incapable of doing royal responsibilities. But in order for this to happen, there should be written confirmation by at least three or more of her consort. To give justifications with this latest report, it was claimed that the Queen had relayed to her inner circle that she would retire from doing royal functions if she was still on the throne at the age of 95. In this case, then, Charles will have to be crowned as the new monarch.